from Divine Sis Star of the Light, Eri Ni, from Crystal and Indigo Guide to the Galaxy. Let us take a moment here, take a few deep, gentle breaths, and allow yourself to be removed from the mind and journey deep into the heart. Be sure to listen to these codes with your sacred heart flame. The birth of the new unified grid the tripartite self and the embodiment of the trinity flame summer solstice 2023 forever summer quantum interconnection 2012 2023 2032 enter dialogue and merging of different timelines the new grid marriage completion the sword the rose and the diamond Divine Kundalini Ignition Preparation for reconnection to the true organic Kundalini nodes Amplified light New information Free flow Unified field The basis upon which masterhood will be achieved The beginning of immortality The sword, the rose, and the diamond Justice just served. The dragon awakens. The treasure is untouched. 3D timeline and further death and separation challenge extremes. Exaltation of the heart. The earth aligning to the future earth. Twins on fast forward to the point of meeting of no return. Go twins. Natural correction synchronization revelation 144,000 inner knowing reassurance the gate of manifestation position taken action seen so it is the holy trinity solstice message the energies that are arriving at this solstice are signaling the end of all false, unnatural, reversed, and distorted triangles and triangulation patterns that have been still active in overwriting the inner and outer flows and fields of creation in this realm. Upon this ending, whatever was supporting relationships, roles, positions, creations and structures based on such distorted patterns will cease to exist and then previously false triangulated support will break this will cause a great wave of sudden chains of reactions this world will never be the same after the solstice this is the last exorcism and liberation of the male from the fallen energies of the dark mother and his rescuing and reconnection to his holy mother his rescue has been prophesied. This will thus also free the holy child creation from the field of the fallen trinity. At the same time, the holy trinity will start being grounded by those who have chosen to embody it. The next three days are important as the process of the final liberation act of the cutting of all the pending ill cords is already taking place, and this period will be the conclusion of it. This means that another very strong stage of the reset is in the works, and this stage is connected to the masculine and the physical expression. The fallen trinity, dark mother, dark father, and the devil's child that has been overriding the creation patterns in this reality and confusing the human perception while occupying the true positions with false roles and identities is being exercised. So all misunderstandings, programs, and deceptions will be eventually seen and most importantly addressed. Conscious correction and restoration of the true creational codes is next. The twin flames are the ones bringing in the new creational patterns. Through the embodiment of their own newborn self, body, soul, spirit, these patterns are based on the Holy Trinity Union. Divine Mother, Divine Father, and the Divine Child, triple DNA flow. So the Twin Flames are assisting the new writing of the code of the new unified field. 
The new unified field will be in the hands of the twin flames. They are the ones who are bringing in their keys as divine creators. They have received their keys long ago, and now at this stage, they are called to bring them to use. Their keys are true, organic, and aligned to the Holy Trinity, and are holding the blessing from all true twin flames and source. These keys are unique, they cannot be copied or manufactured. This is why all distorted plans for an alternate outcome will fail. Go Trinity Power! Go 144,000! Go Twins! Blessings of Self-Recognition and Achievement Summer Solstice 2023 Forever Summer The birth of the new inner and outer points, portals, reconnection to the true memory of life, recovery of the true identity and story, the sword of the light is coming back. He will bring his presence and grace back into this world. This has not happened since a long time. This has not been experienced since a long time. He was pulled, taken away from his divine feminine, in the excuse of a state of emergency. That was the trap that led him into the hands of the fallen ones and their black magic. Leaving his beloved was the goal of those that had set the trap. He felt confused and then angry, disgraced and helpless. How was this possible? The enemy had full control. His beloved was unprotected and there was nothing he could do. He had to take the fallen journey. The pain was such that only the poison of forgetfulness could ease it. He had to follow the cycle through. He fell into the oblivion of his own self and his beloved. He began interacting with the reversed energies and the false beloved while being magnetized into distorted roles and positions. But a part deep in him never stopped longing for her. Even in the deepest parts of the darkness, the reason of his motivating power in everything he did was to find her again, even if he was not consciously aware of it. This part always knew that one day they would be together again. Now the fallen cycle is finally ending. He is coming out of it. He is taking back his pieces that make up his sword of light. His code is here. He is coming back. Can you imagine how this could take place? No one can. His resurrection is to only be experienced, lived. The unexpected is here. This is the essence of his nature. No one can foresee it, but it can be lived by all. And this is now taking place within all. We are still working with the twelve parallel aspects of the self, twin flames. This is the biggest work we have ever done, and it is through it that we are awakening the 144,000 inner code and reading our book of life. Via the marriage of the feminine and the masculine living earth portals, points. The activation of a third point, child portal, is taking place. The return of the Holy Trinity and its living patterns is truly taking place on earth. The newborn points, children, portals will bring both what was missing from the puzzle and the solutions for the new world. Invite them in you and all around you. A new unfolding and blossoming flow is here, one that is beyond our wildest dreams. On this solstice we will work via the Acropolis portal and with the power of the sword. Blessings of love, Erini, Hunama Anata Kumara.